Welcome to the latest episode and today I am with the man, the myth, the legend in person, Mr. Davis. It's been a while since last time we've done this in person. Yes. Cut to that chase. Today we are talking about who you should listen to when you are a new real estate agent. Actually, for what it matters, if you are an agent and you want to learn, and thank you for watching our podcast. If you don't like it, we'll give you your money back, by the way. It's reassuringly free. It reassuringly free, <laughs> but very expensive at the same time. Um, here is the thing, right? You want to learn more. Well, there is so much information online, right? Free. You can go on YouTube and look at all of the Eric videos. You can, you know, the, the real estate gym. Of course, you've got to pay with Tom There's Panos. information everywhere. There's everywhere, right? And most of it, it's free. But it's really what, who you decide to listen to because at the end of the day, there is a lot of people as well that talk real estate that maybe haven't sold more than 10 houses, 50 houses, 100 houses. You know, branch managers, they've never sold a house in their life or they were failed and now they're becoming the trainers of the office, or right? Or 20 years ago. Or 20 years no ago. No one has been like me. Well, you still are though. That's a good thing. That's why you're here with me. Well, at least I'm still in the market, right? Indeed, yeah. indeed. And it's easy to listen to someone that actually just regurgitated the same SHIT without actually have the proof that they're actually successful or have been successful recently, right? So what is your tip when somebody go like, I want to learn more, where shall, I le where shall I go? Who shall I listen to? Well, the classic is you, right? Because everyone... Everyone's the same by treating them differently. And, and like some people love different speakers. Some mm. like us and some don't. Mm. So I think you've just got to go like you did a broad brush, get a whole lot of information and find the people that you connect with and go, right, I'm going to put all my eggs in that basket and run with those people that resonate with you. But it's always good to get a fresh perspective from other people as well. Indeed, indeed. And so if you want to know what I listen to, uh, I don't listen to our podcast because that would be <laughs> egotistical. Uh, but there is a bunch of podcasts out there that I listen. The Tom Penos uh, Million Dollar Agent, yep. huge fan. The Josh Vegan, uh, Vegan, uh, Vegan, Vegan, Vegan. Uh, we know I who you mean. Yeah, yeah, him. <laughs> I listen to his podcast. Uh, the New Zealand Property Market Podcast, which is done by Core Logic. That's where I get my facts because they're very analytical. Yes. Um, there is another guy called. Uh, um, it's called, oh, there's plenty of them around, but I listen to all of them because if I can get one little nugget out of, out of every podcast, then I can incorporate it into my own, then you become a better writer. So how right? do you have time? People are going, how do you have oh, time? Oh my, how many, I spend four hours in the car every day on average. Right, so you're not on the radio, you're not listening to Spotify. You're... Oh, of course I do sometimes, <laughs> but I get a notification on a Monday morning on my way to the office. I know the Josh Vegan podcast, it's released on the Monday morning. By the way, that's what, when our one is released as well. <laughs> but that's what I listen on my way to the office. Charge up, ready to go, I listen to real estate. Most of the stuff I heard it before, but guess what? There is going to be one nugget every now and then, and you go like, "Ooh, that's I haven't or incorporated remind, that." Remind you, right? You a get reminder. lazy. You a stop reminder. doing what made you successful. So, quality information in, quality output coming out. And look, if you want some one-on-one -on -one training, this guy is not as expensive <laughs> as me, but get in touch with us, right? We're here to help for a price. Because everyone's asking for your videos. There was a really good feedback on that law of anticipation. From like, It's funny when you're going around the circles, hey, oh, I like that. How do we get hold of Diego's videos? I'm like, mate, list your house with him and he'll send them to you. Exactly. <laughs> oh, for a price, everything is possible, right? <laughs> hey, guys, thanks for watching. Cut to the chase. See you next week. Thank you so much. Ciao, ciao. In Diego's words.